Where are we going, you guys? We are going on a nature walk, and we're only going to get dandelions for Bobby because he has a lot of them. And what are, and if we go to a neighbor's house and they have a beautiful rose, do we take the whole rose? No, we only no. take one petal. One uh, petal so that the beauty stays there, right? Yeah, maybe if they'll make a really pretty rose you want at someone's house, maybe we can take one petal. Mm-hmm. Well, if we ask in case we can have one, then we can have a petal. Okay. Like I took all the petals. <laughs> okay, well, let me get my <laughs> shoes on and then we're going to go. Get hey guys, welcome back to Lima Bean Living. If you're new here, my name is Emily. Welcome to my motherhood channel where I take care of all things mom. In today's video, I thought I would just take you along as we go on a little nature walk with the kids. The weather is beautiful. It's like bright and sunny but still nice and have like a cool breeze so it's the perfect time to go on a walk and my kids have been loving walking up the hill and picking flowers or petals so I thought I would take an idea I saw off TikTok get some cardboard and make some designs and punch some holes in it and put the flowers or more like dandelions we collect in the holes to kind of create and finish the picture so let's go ahead and do that now. Oh, you can definitely pick our flowers. You can get the whole thing of our flowers, sweetie, and you can put it in your vase. Mm -hmm. Like stick the stick in the hole. It looks beautiful. Yeah. And then when I go home, I'm gonna... Let's find some more, okay? Yeah. Let's go uphill. Uh -huh. uh -huh. Hold on, Aubrey. Uh-oh. Get your flower. Put it in the hole, Bubba. Thank you. I got a dandelion. Let's put dandelion. it in the hole. Huh? Okay, watch. Oh, yay. Dandelion. Uh-oh. I don't think this is going to last. Little man, you got to keep the flowers in. Good job, Aubrey. I even got my prettiest flowers. Mm -hmm. Do you want to walk the coyote way after I'm done picking one more flower? No, we can just keep walking this way. Is it rest time? Again, go. 
You little balanced beamer, come on. You're desperate for a rest, huh? You special kid. What do you hear? Gaggy. Gaggy bo. The doggy? Yeah. Hey, let's go get Aubrey. You see the water? All right. Okay, let's go get Aubrey. There's water, yeah. Fake glasses. They got up. Mommy, are these both the same glasses that Mommy picked up now? No, I think he got some from our house. Is that one from Dale? I think so, yeah. Yeah. I'm ready to make a glass. Bobby, I'm not Why? Why would you like me to walk backwards? So you can see if you go off that like I could. Oh. Do it. Can you walk backwards, Bubba? I can walk backwards. Good job. We have time walking. Very I cool. I'll back you because that way you're not like pick everybody else's. I There's one pedal. These are so pretty. Oh, oh, pretty. Yeah, very pretty. What flowers are these? Look. I don't know. We'll have to look it up. Cloud pack. Those Yay. might be poppies. Cloud I don't know. Cloud pack. Cloud pack. What do you see, Bubba? I see a dog. I, I saw a dandelion. Take it. Nice. Cloud Put it in a hole. Cloud you see, pack. You see the car? Whoa, yeah. Say bye bye to the car. All right, let's go get some more dandelions. There's a lot right here. There's a lot of dandelions. We can put some more on our dandelion. Uh -huh. Mommy, look, a flower fell. Look, look, a flower fell. Wow. Hey, and there's a snail over here hiding. Well, well. Right there. See the snail? Yeah. Ooh, we be gentle with the snail. We just look, okay, Bubba? Be tall. Snail. That's like turbo. Hi, turbo. When you like broken something and he hides. Mm -hmm. like... Oh, the poor dandelion. Wait, Bubby. <laughs> Aubrey, what, show the camera. What? Let me see yours. I got pretty flowers. You did. And Bubby, then show Bubby the lion. Yeah, we're almost complete with its mane. Yeah, I'm almost complete. With Bubby's that. having too much fun with okay. the snail, which may or may not be dead. I don't know. The snail's right there, yeah. Mommy, look. Oh, oh look. that's beautiful, Aubrey. Look Great job. Look at all these beautiful ones. Nice. A coconut. Okay, Bubba, all done. Coconut. Yucky, yucky. Coconut. Coconut. No. There's a birdie on it? Mm -hmm. Film it! Film the birdie? Okay. It's the the next door.
So overall, I had a little fun time with my kids going on that little neighborhood walk. The dandelion ended up being completed by yours truly because my son is more interested in, in wandering on other people's properties. So I had to put this down a lot and go get him and you know save other plants in our neighbor's yards. But you know, Aubrey, on the other hand, had a great time on this little activity. She loved walking around, getting petals from our neighbors, flowers from like the public areas and you know, any other like weeds or like dandelion type flowers that she could pick in its entirety, as well as flowers from our yard. I'm trying to teach her like all flowers in our yard you can pick. Like I'm okay with that, especially when you have lantanias, they have so many flowers, like you pick 20 and you can't tell a difference. But I was like, the only flowers you cannot pick in our, yard, in our yard are like the fruit tree or blueberry plant or things like that because that will actually produce fruit and that is what its purpose is for. So I think she's learning it. This guy, on the other hand, it's gonna take a few years. But overall, I really do like this little idea. This cardboard I think was like in some sheet packages like for bed sheets so i made sure to save it because it was like the perfect size for some type of craft and you know the perfect size for this activity today you could make a bunch of different you know varieties of animals and have you know it be like you can pick flowers for a mane on a horse if you can draw a horse's profile or something like that you could make a little teddy bear or really whatever animal you want or in Aubrey's case a simple vase with little stems and then poking holes at the ends of those to put the flowers in. Yeah? Mm -hmm. You Did you have fun on the walk? Okay. Um, anyways, you know, that's a really simple and obvious use of the holes for the flowers. So anything like that, um, especially, you know, Aubrey's five and a half, I think that's a good age. She loved going on nature walks when she was like three. So from three to who knows when, I think this would make a great activity. But I'd like to thank you guys for watching. If you guys are new here, I would love it if you stick around and subscribe. Don't forget to hit that thumbs up button and I will catch you guys in the next one. to the end of the video. If you didn't know already, every Monday and Friday you can find motherhood and lifestyle content on this channel. And since us moms have to do it all, that may mean yummy recipes, easy DIYs, mom hacks, cleaning and organization, or just a combo of everything. Please know that you are loved and you are made for greatness, and I will catch you in the next one.